Hey guys, uh, my name's Ray, this is Andrew, and we're here with What's So Not. We're playing Street Fighter Turbo Edition on Super Nintendo. Let's beat each other off, I guess. What? What? Yeah, I was going Did you just say what I think you said? <laughs> You're in the US a lot. How do you stay from being homesick? I made a rule with my mom. This is really cute. I, for Christmas, I said that I would call her once a week. That was her present. Because she was like, you, ne good. you never call me, you're always away, and I only hear from you when there's problems. <laughs> 2011, in like three sentences. 2011, I think, was the year we put out the first What's In Odd EP. 2012. 2012 was when I left my job, went overseas with all my buddies, and traveled around South America for a while, came back, and was like, I'm just going to do music for the rest of my life. I remember you were DJing at Strike Bowling Bar and I'm like, I hadn't seen you in ages. Uh-huh, uh-huh. And I was like, hey man, what are you up to? And you're like, I just decided to quit my job. <laughs> man, the future looks bright. <laughs> yeah. I got this sick gig DJing in a bowling alley. I get a free pizza <laughs> yeah. and two free beers. That was the start of What's So Not. There's hope. That was it, man. That was it. There's hope for everyone out there. There is hope for everyone. Let's just skip to 2015. Highlight of 2015 the highlight. is... I think the highlight of 2015 is for what's to come in the rest of the year and beyond that. And I think this is the most excited I've ever been about anything in my whole life. I thought seeing us today was going to be the most exciting yeah. thing, but let's move on. <coughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> You've got a list of songs now that people want to hear. Mm. And whereas like the way that I remember you was it was just sporadic and like kind of like spontaneous and you'd just mm. be like whatever the feeling of the room was. I hate when you go to a show and someone just like hits play on their record and then hits play on their next record and you're like, man, yeah. I, got a, I got a playlist of your stuff at home. I could have just like sat in my yeah, iTunes. Yeah, pay so you, to watch exactly. You so, the track after. Um, do, do people get that upset? Do fans like... I've had some really good moments with fans where they've come up to me after the show and they haven't been happy. And they've told me and I take that on board and I think that's... What? It's like, it's so important. Like uh, I had a guy in Perth and he was like, why didn't you play more of the unreleased stuff? And I was like, you're right. Why yeah. didn't? <laughs> like, I should have played more of the unreleased stuff, and I didn't. And I had a stack, and then the next night, I completely changed the whole set. That's yeah. cool. What about some random people that have turned up to your shows, like celebrities? Well, I, I had um, Jaden Smith. His buddy high-fived me, like, great show, man. And then he came to fist pump, but I was still in high five mode. And I just <laughs> Typical had- Typical Aussie thing to yeah, do. Yeah, I just, I was just the biggest Aussie like. Can we reenact it? Is it possible? Sick show, man. Thanks, bro. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Thanks, Jaden Smith. <laughs> hey, this is Emo from What's So Not. We're here on Versus. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Uh, and tune in next week for the best episode yet. <laughs>